Hey guys, it's Calvin, and this is The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. And there has been an update to the game here. There has been an update to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. And I have to say, it's an instantaneous improvement. Uh, I don't usually say that about games, because usually updates, I don't even notice the difference. But what I'm noticing here is that in areas that the frame rate would be really choppy, it's actually pretty good. You know, I maybe, uh, maybe it's just because my eye doesn't really care about frame rate, but it's actually pretty good. So here is the Lost Woods. Now, I don't know for definite if the Master Sword is in here, but they did say that it was hidden away in the woods, right? I do know. I do know, and I'm always going to be full full disclosure with stuff I do know. This is a blind playthrough, but I do know that it has something to do with those particles that are flying through the air. I guess... Do they mean the fire particles, I wonder, is it? Or the... 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 I guess we can follow the... 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 the, the, the white particles. It probably makes more sense when they said particles. It's kind of funny, though, because... On Twitter now... Instead of, like... Oh, shit. Oh, I did it wrong, did I? Maybe I'm doing the wrong thing. I have to follow the particles in the air? On Twitter now, uh, people will do news stories. Uh, wait a second. It can't be the- it, maybe it's the fire particles, actually. Yeah, it's probably the fire particles. But we have to- oh, okay, it is. It totally is. Yeah, it, look, it totally is. Watch. We have to go this direction. Uh... The direction which the particles is going, actually, is probably the best bet. So... Here? Um... Over in this direction? Too far? No? It's, it's, it seems to be okay. But yeah, on, on, and on Twitter now, it's like... No one respects the idea of, like, having a blind playthrough anymore, which is, like, really funny to me. In this direction, I guess. Too far? It said go in this direction. I haven't gone too far yet because the fog hasn't gotten me yet, but... Maybe I'm, do actually, maybe I'm actually doing this right. No, there it is. There it is. Okay. Um, I did it wrong there. But on, on people, on stories that they do about, like, the Lost Woods... Um, the, oh, oh, it's a checkpoint? Okay, cool. So, it's around here, so it's... It's telling me to go in this direction. I guess I should look for the next fire. Because that seems to be what the, the theme is here. I just want me to go up. I press down to light a torch. Uh, because I've been playing Salt and Sanctuary over the past uh, couple of days. Um... Is it wrong again? Am I, am I wrong again in doing this? Do I climb into the mouth? Where am I going? I want- uh, is there a fire nearby? Cause this is just going in the same direction it went last time, it's probably not gonna work out. There we go. No, no, I'm sorry. So this is right. This direction here, I'm guessing, then. Do I go over here? There's a shrine nearby, anyway. So maybe I'm going in the right direction. But I feel like I'm leaving the Lost Woods doing this. Let's see. No, no! Damn it! We gotta stick to the path. Man, I really do hope the Master Sword is actually in here, though. Maybe I have to follow this one. That's pointing over there. In that direction. 
Let's see if this changes directions at any point. Nope. I don't get it. It says follow this direction. That's where the particles are going in. And that seems to be the right thing that I've been doing so far. And I do love, the, I do like these type of puzzles though. The Lost Woods has always been a magical place to me. In all, in all fairness, it's always also been like one of my favorite places in in the game. No, no. What do I do, man? What can I do? Okay. Um. Oh. Do I pick use this torch? Do I use the torch? This fog's getting kind of scary. Are we going in the right direction? We could be. Um. Do we go down here? Oh my god, me yes, okay, good. I should have gone down to the, into this clearing. We got it. It took a while, but we did it. By we, I mean me. Again, I don't mean to pander to people. Guys, we did it together. I'm pretty sure I uh, was moving the thumbsticks. Are you serious? We got here? You're joking. We're, we were here. Look at all the fucking Koroks. Korok Forest, man. No way, man. No way. Do I have enough hearts? One. I might not have enough hearts. No way, it looks so fucking beautiful. Link, you are our final hope. The fate of Hyrule rests with you. Fuck, man. No, no, no. Oh my god, I don't think I'm ready. Man, this is my favorite part of the game all the time. <sighs> Oh, who is that? Did I doze off again? Hmm. Well, well. It's you. You finally decided to return. Better late than never. After 100 years, I've nearly given up hope on seeing you again. Even my patience has limits, you know. That look on your face tells me that you have no recollection of me, however. I have watched over Hyrule since time immemorial. Many have referred to me over the ages as the Deku Tree. That is the weapon created by the ancient goddess. The sword that seals the darkness that only the Chosen Knight can wield against the Calamity Ganon. Believe it or not, it was actually you who wielded that sword 100 years ago. But I must warn you to take extreme caution. The sword stands as a test to anyone who would dare attempt to possess it. As you are now, I cannot say whether you are worthy or not. If you sought to free the sword in any sort of weakened state, you would surely lose your life where you stand. <laughs> Best of luck, young one. Jesus Christ, guys. Oh my God. 
Do I like I like it? It's like it's really hard to count the hearts on the screen. Uh, okay, it cuts through bravado and superficial enhancements. Only true strength can draw it from its resting place. The only way to know if what you ha if you have what it takes is to try. Oh my god! Oh my god! So it's so. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, let's do it. I think I might have enough. Well, oh no. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Yes! <laughs> we have the Master Sword! <laughs> oh my god, Link, you're so fucking badass. Your master will come for you. Until then... You shall rest safely here. Although the slumber of restoration will most certainly deprive him of his memories, please trust me when I say that I know he will arrive before you yet again. If I may be so bold, what is it that you are planning to do next, princess? Master Sword, I heard it speak to me. It seems that my role is unfinished. There is still something I must do. I sense there is great strength in your dedication. Great Dekutri, I ask of you, when he returns, can you please relay this message? Tell him I... Now then. Words intended for him would sound much better in the tones of your voice, don't you think? Yes. What you just saw happened where you stand 100 years ago. After you were separated from the sword, the princess thought to bring it here where she knew that it would be safe under my watch. She continues to fight, trapped deep within the confines of Hyrule Castle. Her heart cascades with faith that you will return. She has a smile like the sun. I would do much to feel its warmth upon me once again. So we have a Master Sword. That blade has a name. It is the Master Sword. When used against Calamity Ganon, or those tainted in malice, it will become suffused in holy light. 
At such times, the true power of the soul will manifest, but be warned, do not rely too much on its power. If you wield without need, its power will exhaust and no longer be of use to you. Should this happen, you must wait for the sword to recover. It will be rash to rely on this sword alone to defeat Ganon. I suggest you free the divine beast before facing him. Can I... Can I wield the sword? They, they, they gave me an extra slot for the master sword. Can I use this against bosses? So many questions. Oh my god. Whew. Where's that shrine at? Where's that shrine at? Hey Maraca baby, how you doing baby? You're looking good. You looking good Maraca baby. There's a shrine over here. Let's close out the episode by doing this. The Kyorug Shrine. Oh man, I don't think we're done here though. I think we gotta talk to a few people. Oh man. This is this is so exciting. Um if I had to rate it like right now, all my favorite Master Sword reveals, uh, I think the best Master Sword reveal is in Wind Waker. I think then it's Twilight Princess. I really like the one in Link Between Worlds and Link to the Past. I don't know where this ranks. Um I love the Twilight Princess one a lot. Like, a lot. And the Wind Waker one. To you, sets foot in the shrine. I'm Q-Rogue. The name is... Okay. Fateful stars. Okay, let's see what it says. Uh, look to the stars for guidance. The constellations are the key. Are you fucking serious? <laughs> I have to fucking... What? What stars? Up here? Up here, I have to wait and see where the stars are. Okay, I did it. Okay, good. That's fine. That's fine. That wasn't too hard. I think it's just... By too hard, I meant I spent quite a while on it. It was confusing as hell. Uh, okay, let's see what we have here. Do we have any chests around the place? Nope, just a shrine to do. That's fine. Especially in this area, because it'd be nice to travel back. First of all, we should take out the Master Sword for a second. Oh, man. What the fuck is up with that slash? Look how, look how fast it is. Jesus Christ. Guys, can you answer if you can use it on bosses or not? By the way, I should put on some better armor, like... Wearing the master sword, for fuck's sake. Put on my best armor. Now I look like a fucking beast. Let's get this. Man, I've been having so much fun with the, this this game, even more lately. It gets even more and more fun after a while. The fact that I've spent like about 28 days playing this game, you know, it it it, it feels good. It feels really, really good to say I'm still playing this game. Is that a garbage truck outside? Might be. It might be a kind of truck. I don't know. Alright, guys, so that's going to do it for this episode, and I'll talk to you in the next one.